Good morning Britain's Kate Garraway and this morning's Alison Hammond looked into their ancestry on Thursday night during an episode of ITV's DNA Journey. However, during the show, Kate reflected on her husband Derek Draper's condition who after being hospitalised with COVID-19 in 2020, requires around-the-clock care. On DNA Journey, she reflected, 2020 was a devastating year. With Derek, he got very sick very early on in the pandemic and has remained very damaged. That is quite well documented because for a lot of people, has come to symbolise the fight that goes on. Kate highlighted the support she received from her ITV co-star Alison. She was messaging me to say she was thinking of me in that way, Kate added. She explained, I dramatically disappeared and haven't been here for three weeks, now we're on air, and Derek had come out of hospital, he's been going in and out of hospital for a while, for looking at ways to tackle the damage caused by COVID back in 2020. But we haven't really had any sort of medical eruptions, and then he just was really unwell. So it was really dramatic, brilliant work by the A&E, absolutely extraordinary because when you've got sepsis, the big challenge is to find the source of infection quickly and get the right antibiotics, and his blood pressure was so low. Meanwhile, Alison looked into her ancestry during a trip to Jamaica with Kate on DNA Journey. She was told her great-great-great-grandfather Jean Maria Scoffery was deported from Jamaica to the Dominican Republic unlawfully. He had been accused of selling guns before a pubic inquiry proved his innocence, and he was allowed to return home. Jean was given £16,000 in damages, the equivalent of £50 million in today's money. Elsewhere, Kate discovered she is related to Michael Bond, the creator of Paddington Bear. She met with Karen Jankel, the daughter of the later author. They were told they share the same three times great-grandparent. <laughs>